that's fine. Nah, don't hide from the camera. Hey, everybody, welcome back to the Carter Staff. And unfortunately, Anna is not here. She's, um... Shadow Realm himself. <laughs> <laughs> so, I see you, too. <laughs> Bruh. But anyway, this is me and Doppler today. Uh -huh. And, um... We've been playing a lot of Black Ops 3 Zombies recently. And this brought up the question. How the fuck would you kill different supernaturals? Especially a fucking skeleton. Cause, yeah. zombie, cause zombies, you know, you blow off their head or destroy their brain. Demons, Werewolves, you just hit it's their silver head. bullets. It's vampires, anything silver, supposedly. That's vampires, it's to the heart. But skeletons. How would you are, take that down? Because it's it's a re, it's reanimated bones. There's nothing to kill. Wait, well, I don't know how to be petty towards one. <laughs> you just take one of their. <laughs> you take their femur. <laughs> you do you do what they did in Coco. Where's my femur? <laughs> Give me that. When I was gonna say, take off his head, get a homie, and play monkey in the middle. I thought you were going to say, start playing soccer with that. <laughs> that too. Or bowling. Fucking I mean, Lego. Not over. Fucking Lego. <laughs> this is like mice. Just, alright. <laughs> Throw like a basketball. What, what, Throw like a basketball, basketball forget huh? it to skull, and then just slam it on the ground as, a, as you try to dribble it. What? And why why bring in basketball, huh? Why why you huh? go straight to basketball? Why I went to, to soccer huh? first. <laughs> I went to soccer first. You went to monkey in the middle. <laughs> but, uh, also, another supernatural I'm I'm curious about how you would kill is an angel. Yeah, that's that that's true. Because demons, at least in we kind of know how to kill demons. Holy water, salt, Exorcism. anything, anything <laughs> holy. So, but like an I, angel. I, I thought I heard you say saw for a second. But like an angel, you, you, you can't, you don't really know how to kill one of those. You turn the cross upside down and start using that against them. Because <laughs> <laughs> you, you know, you know what upside down cross means, right? Yeah, that's the satanic one. Yeah, it's 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 a disrespect to Jesus who was nailed to the cross and turned upside down. But um wait, I know I know a different way. Just rip off his halo and be like, nah, I'm not giving this back, this mine now. You can live, but you're not getting this halo back. Touch if you I'm pretty sure if you touch it it becomes impure. And then it becomes a duck oh. and then it becomes a ball. Oh, we're both impure as fuck, so like yoink what the fuck wings turn black all of a sudden all right but oh look like i don't love you no more <laughs> so you a demon now well technically fallen angels aren't necessarily demons they're they're close enough to them yeah they're they're in the middle of angels they're in the middle middle of like holy beings and demons because they're there are angels who have committed sin. That's what I've heard. Uh, there are angels who committed sin. Every human is a fallen true. angel, and and they're trying and they're trying to get their place back in heaven. That's what so it that's, is supposed to be. Wait, so does that mean every human is just a fallen angel? Yes. <laughs> oh well, shit. We lost our spot. Damn. And Damn. then depend and then depending on what you do. Depending on what you do means that you either become an angel or you stay a fallen angel and then you become a devil and then you become a demon afterwards. Oh shit. We're fucked. Yeah, 100%. We're becoming demons. But, um, but what's what's another supernatural? Like, how would you kill. I mean, like, I guess you could kill. Um, how would you kill a siren? That's 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 like the 
mermaid, right? Like, like the actual mermaid. It's, it's, it's a mer, it's a type of mermaid that leads that leads sailors to their death by luring them. Easy, not going to fucking water. Not be a fucking sailor. <laughs> <laughs> I said how to kill them, not how to avoid. <laughs> not how to survive. How do you kill them? Bring them bitches out of water and eat that motherfucker. <laughs> Turn them into sashimi. But, <laughs> but no, if I'm at the beach or like or like the ocean or whatever, and I hear singing from the water. Uh, well, time for me to pack the fuck up, get the fuck out of here, and pretend I don't see shit. All right. Uh, what's the name? Oh, How would you take oh, a bigfoot? That's a supernatural technique. Same way I took that nigga down to Red Dead Redemption in GTA 5. Shoot the motherfucker. <laughs> Shoot him till he's dead. By the way, do you want to play the game Bigfoot? There's a game, there's an actual game big, called Bigfoot. Oh, hell yeah. Yeah. But I'm still no, right you track down, if I see... you, you track down Bigfoot, you like you have guns and all, and you just try to bleed him to death. Oh, that game. Yeah. Oh, shit, I forgot about that game. Damn. But nah, if I see Bigfoot and he's on some hostile type shit, and I'm and I'm trying to clear peace. Nah, at that point, I, if I'm really nah, he, I'm trying to be peaceful. You want to attack? Bow. Just pulls out a shotgun. <laughs> but yeah. What about a cyclops? Those are kind of like trolls, right? Trolls, ogres, whatever you want to call them. Just that they have one eye. <laughs> you think they um, taste good? I mean, <laughs> there are some. There are some fantasy like things where they do talk about how and how a cyclops taste. I don't remember what they were, but you know, they 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 said it tastes pretty good. A little bit like chewy. Oh wait, wait! I know one that I, I I I probably don't have a chance of beating for my whole life. In Oni. Ah, oh, fuck that! That's just a demon, no. though, isn't it? It's a demon from though. Japan. Yeah. <laughs> you know, you know, but, you know they demons on a whole nother tier from American demons. Yeah, no, they they are they are something else. If we're going, if we're going based on supernaturals, as in like anything being, in terms in terms of movie supernaturals, what would you? How Never how do you think? How do you? <laughs> Boy, <laughs> <laughs> fucking pogo stick your ass! <laughs> Once again, you just see that boy. If I die from a leprechaun using a fucking pogo stick on me, I, I don't don't steer me to the afterlife. Cause they ask me how I die, I'm a lie. I'm like, um, <laughs> accident. What's up? Like, accident. Like I come in, I come in. Oh, hey, buddy. So I heard, I heard you died from a pogo stick. Yeah, no, it's been, it's been twenty years. How you been? It's like, what the fuck? <laughs> you just, you just look at me. You just look at me like, like oh, you bitch. <laughs> but um, what you, what you gonna say about the movie one? Uh, how would you, how how would you kill Michael Myers? Shoot him and make sure he's not moving. The, listen, the, no, the no, because he, he is right. You know what he is, right? He's supposed to be an immortal, like that's the non-canon defense. ones. Really? Uh, uh, yeah. I don't know. I heard. Gonna... I remember that. Yeah, I heard that he's supposed to be an immortal being that's like cursed to like kill his kill his like heritage. Family yeah, that yeah, that's from, that's from the non-canon movies. Is going off the canon movies. Hold on. Um, I'm gonna make sure that nigga not moving after I shoot him, cause they they just be shooting him in the shoulders and stuff and walking off, and turning their backs and shit. Oh, he's focusing. Is Michael Myers immortal? In the original timeline, Halloween's boogeyman is as immortal as Thorn's supernatural gifts will allow. What the fuck? <laughs> but once again, remember, being immortal doesn't mean you're invulnerable. 
it, no, it, well, it, dep- it depends on which, it depends on which immortal they're using, right? Because... Uh, let, let's just go, let's just make it easy and go off the canon version. Yeah, because, like, because the, cause the logical immortality means that your mortality is no longer existent. You just can't die from old age anymore. You just, ne- you just don't age, basically. You're perpetually in a state of health. But you can die from bullet wounds, you can die from, like, getting hit by a car and all that. That's that's what that's what log that's what like the definition of immortality. However, what everyone else everyone else uses is immortality means that you're invulnerable to everything. You can't if you if you take damn if you take like any oh, sort man. of if you're inflicted with any sort of wound you will heal or like something like that. It's like what the fuck? Where are you getting this? This is DC comic <laughs> logic at that uh, point. No, back back to Michael Myers. Um, going off the canon one. Yeah, no, they just be shooting him in the shoulder, just hitting him with household objects and stuff, not making sure that he stopped breathing or nothing. No, I'm putting, I'm making him look like SpongeBob. I'm, I'm making sure that nigga. Like, there's, there's these no two people, secret. there's these two people, right, who shoot him, he's on the ground, and then there's you comes in, move the fuck out of the way. <laughs> <laughs> he's got an AR-15. <laughs> It's like, Resolve. dude, he's dead. Nah, he ain't dead. <laughs> like, nah, I saw that finger twitch. <laughs> uh-huh, uh-huh. I see your feet moving. <laughs> no, no, buddy. I'm like, doctor, get the chainsaw. We gotta cut him up. <laughs> They're like, this is too brutal. It's like, no, it's not. This guy's trying to murder us four different times. Too brutal? Man, fuck that. But, okay, got the limbs. Doctor, you take the arms, dump them in this lake, and then you dump the legs in this lake. I'll take the head and torso and dump them in the ocean. <laughs> and if this nigga come back, we leaving. If, if this guy comes back, he's Exodia. Because someone found all the pieces. Exodia! <laughs> 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 hey, like, that's... <laughs> Found <laughs> all the pieces <laughs> and part this nigga back in my kids. <laughs> oh, and Anna would have loved that joke. It's, so <laughs> it's like, okay, where do we put the torso? Uh, we just someone someone just keeps it in their house. <laughs> just like, just right, have it yeah. mounted over the fireplace. <laughs> Yeah, and then what? And then one, and then one day, someone breaks in. Someone breaks in. It's like, yo, someone broke in. It's like, what they take? They took the torso. Shit, they're trying to build them back. But okay, get the guns. Round two. <laughs> it's like, all right, we gotta find this guy. It's like, do you guys remember where you put the parts? Like, I just dumped them in the Mariana Trench. So, <laughs> I dumped mine. I dumped mine in the Bermuda Triangle. So that shame, he found nowhere. <laughs> No, no, he, he just come back missing half his limbs and shit. <laughs> it's like, it's like, buddy, what's just happening? On, uh, just hopping on one leg, one arm. One well, leg, like, like, one arm. <laughs> it's all on the right side. The left side's gone. He's <laughs> like, damn, they actually brought this nigga back. His, head, his head has a... His head has a chewed mark in his face from the from like everything that's been biting his head. It's like, damn, this nigga, this nigga a fighter. Anyways, <laughs> anyways, ready? Hey, <laughs> so fucking, fucking, just obliterate him until there's like zero atoms of him left. It's like, all right, now try to well, build that shit together. <laughs> try to put that thing together. Firing squad. <laughs> kill, kill him. Then just throw him. Just then just throw him in the um, in the uh, what is it? Uh, Meat grinder. Is that? No. Uh, I I can't I can't remember I can't remember that process. The process the process of when like you when you decide to like make your body into ash. Oh, cream. Oh, cremation. Cremate. Cremation. Yeah. <laughs> just throw him in there. <laughs> Be like, yep, nothing's left there. They ain't bringing this guy back anymore. <laughs> he's gonna sit. Uh, he's gonna sit in a dog's ass. Since we're bringing up horror movie supernatural beings, 
if Jason. you die, no, no, if you die by Chucky, you deserved it. If, if you, you died by Chucky, shit. if you died by Chucky, you're a dumb ass. <laughs> you fucking punt the his nigga, ass. <laughs> the nigga's like, what, two, three feet tall? <laughs> they just punt him, just, all right, do 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 do. All right, uh, let me take off my gym shoes, put on my boots. Let me put on these cleats. <laughs> sure, with these spiky cleats, anything's possible. <laughs> <laughs> I just punt the shit out of them. Cleats? <laughs> See, that's, that's, why, that's why horror movie characters tend to stay off the hood. Because, uh... They'll get jumped, shot, and stumped out all in the first 10 minutes. The only person who was not afraid of it was Leprechaun. <laughs> and guess what? Every time he went there, he got shot up. Yeah. Here's the funny thing. <laughs> if Chucky goes walking into a neighborhood like that, you just pick him up. Football! <laughs> <laughs> Just hold him down. No, hold him down on the ground. All right. All right. Kick him. <laughs> but now, uh, on, on, on the topic of more supernaturals, Jason, how would you take care of him? <laughs> Wait, what's Jason we talking about? Uh, uh, Jason goes to New York. What's that one? Oh, the, okay, one the one easy. that just the one that recently just came out of the water. <laughs> Okay, yeah, that's easy. I know exactly how I'm gonna deal with this situation. I mean, didn't didn't they melt his ass? They melted him. <laughs> no, no, no. Here's how. Here's exactly how I'm gonna deal with this, Jason. Run, run the fuck away. <laughs> <laughs> I I'm thought you had a plan. <laughs> that is the plan. Run. <laughs> My plan is getting the fuck. <laughs> why? Why would I sit there and be like, you know what? In honor of Julio, yeah, run them hands. Or no, no. Cause look, look, I'm trying right now. The moment I throw one punch and he just eats that shit and looks down at me. Yeah, I'm gonna hit that Darwin one. You you, you remember every time Darwin was away in Gumball? Yeah, I'm yeah. gonna hit that shit. <laughs> I'm gonna hit that Scooby Doo running. <laughs> yeah, you're gonna you're gonna hit that Jerry. You're gonna hit that Tom run just. <laughs> Like, sorry for your troubles, mister. <laughs> like, you know what? This is not even the right movie I'm supposed to be in. This is not even my city, for real. I'm out. <laughs> it's just dip. Yeah, no, that, that Jason is not something that he does. Especially None since... None of them. Oh. Uh, yeah. Any Jason after human Jason, don't deal with it. Hey. Like, the... The one, the one where they put him in the water, that one was already creepy enough. <laughs> uh. -uh. Speaking of Jason, how would you deal with Freddy Krueger? I'm gonna just roast his ass. Be scared, be scared of something that will make you eventually horny. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, not big titty. <laughs> No, 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 you, no. you know, you know, people can loophole his power, right? No, no, Doppler, you just sitting, you just sitting up with the bottle of lotion, like, no, no, not big, <laughs> <laughs> no, not big anime <laughs> girl. <laughs> and it's a cop one. No, it's a whole not big, not big cat girl. No. <laughs> just, Don't. just preparing, just preparing the thing. <laughs> Don't suck my dick. Don't do that. He's he's looking at you like, ah, oh, be fair. What the fuck is happening here? <laughs> it's like, yeah, no. It's like, ah, I I used your power against you, bitch. <laughs> it's like I thought you were scared of this. Yes, but you do realize when you're afraid, you're when you're afraid, your hormones go real rapid when you're afraid. Because when you have the fear of death, when you have the fear of death, you have like the uh primal instinct to mate when you're on the verge of death. Who doesn't want to go out fucking? <laughs> I was gonna say, could you imagine could you imagine on the on the battlefield someone's like, oh my god. 
You know, they they just be, they just bleeding out. They just they just sitting there jerking off one last time. <laughs> they just they just sitting there beating it. Like a guy a guy comes a guy comes in. Oh, I'm the medic. What the fuck is happening? <laughs> it's like oh, I I I think I'm gonna die. It's like yeah, but then it's like why have your dick out? It's like why why are you beating it? It's like uh, one last oh. time. one final jerk. Wait, funny thing, that, like, that that actually happened to a dude, and I think it was in Pompeii. They dug up his skeleton, and they found him. Just... <laughs> 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 they go and hey, hey. out there in Pompeii. <laughs> hey, if you're gonna go down, go down, go down in your way. <laughs> go down in your own way, sure. It was fucked up because his skeleton was still in the same position. <laughs> Hold on, hold on. Look. Look that I don't think that was Pompey. <laughs> Pompey. Pompey. What do I even look up for that jerking skeleton man? <laughs> yeah, what the fuck do you look up for this thing? Yeah, this two thousand year old masturbating Pompeii Pompeii man is going, <laughs> yep, viral. It's going viral. Cause for oh he died. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, bro, bro fixed it. No, he he asphyxiated himself. Boy, y'all who bro, look at this shit. <laughs> Have you ever wondered what you'd do if the world was ending and you had minutes to live? Well, this guy appears Check to have one phone. suggestion. <laughs> this is Open the pose. Our phone, go to... <laughs> wait, wait, wait. This is the pose that our hero has has lain in for about 2,000 years after being killed by an eruption of Mount Vesson. That is, he was an inhabitant of Pompeii. <laughs> Millennia is finding internet fame, but as Twitter goes into meltdown, scientists had has to ask: Did this guy really die masturbating? Probably not. <laughs> Look at the position. Look at. Hold on. Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. The remaining seven hundred fifty-six victims were killed by a pyro pyroclastic surge, a column of superheated gas, and ash released from a volcano. It's highly unlikely that our protagonist actually died midway through some action. <laughs> no, he oh, clearly shit. died. The gas, oh, the gas, the gas and ash may have caused asphyxiation, or it may have killed Pompey's residents with a thermal shock that rapidly cooked their bodies. This causes instant muscle stiffening, known as cadaveric shock, which would explain the apparent gas uh, grasping pose. Seen in many different Pompey day. victims, the invasion. No. Yeah, the is an adult man killed by the hot pyroclastic surge, whose both arms, whose both arms and legs flex due to the heat. Nah, man, this guy a hundred percent jerked himself to death. <laughs> it's on his, it's on his body. Bro, bro was jerking. Bro was finishing as he sees his, as he sees his dick evaporating. <laughs> Immature. Very immature as fuck. We were, we were talking about how to kill skeletons and angels and shit. So a dude dying in Pompeii jerking off. Hell yeah. <laughs> oh fuck. But no, but, yeah, no, when no, I, no, I know another person who, if you die from him, you kind of deserved it, or you have to be a little kid, Pennywise. Yeah, I mean, like in terms of in terms of the adults, in terms of the adults, their fears just increased because he fed off the trauma, wasn't it? Like that was how that worked. He fed off their trauma. Yeah. But no, I ain't gonna lie. If I saw Pennywise, if I saw I'm Pennywise, shit. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm stomp you. Right? I'm shit talking. I'm stomping his ass. I'm stomping his ass, and I'm t- I'm saying, what you what is this 1980s clown doing here? No, no, no. He's like, 
and, I'm, and then I'm gonna take I'm gonna take I'm gonna take out a knife and be like, hey, you want a balloon? No, no balloon. <laughs> But you want some new clothing? You look like you look like you're from the past. Bro literally looked like he came from nineteen eighties. Oh, you look like a rejected clown dresser from for the royal family. Yeah. Well, That's like the only clown to, to get rejected from clown college. Well, I mean, here's the thing. Are we talking about the old one or the recent one? The new one? Both. Both. Because the old one was yellow. He was actually a clown. I w- I'm still going to shit talk about him. It don't matter. I'm, I'm going to shit talk him ass because I don't I don't care. Like, I may be afraid of clowns. Not that clown. That clown, I'm fine. I don't go. <laughs> that clown's fine. He's like, you want a balloon? <laughs> he goes, you want a balloon? I was like, you want some bitches with your stank booty ass, nigga? I know you need a shower to in this sewer and shit. It's like, you want to like, get out of there and actually go and get a be- and get a decent meal? You look like you haven't eaten anything. It's like, oh, I've been hungry for quite a bit. <laughs> it's like, yeah, no, and I assume you're probably still going to starve. Oh, but let me guess, Ronnie. You, you want McDonald's? You want a Big Mac? You want a double cheeseburger? You want to order from the dollar menu? <laughs> <laughs> You want a you want a, you want an extra small water cup that's a hot that's a dollar seventy nine. I pro- I promise you, don't have me and Doppler in a in a like a serious situation. Cause we won't be no help. We'll just be shit talking though. No, yeah, like, no. Oh, if, oh, if, if, if I'm by myself, if I'm by myself, it will it will be slightly fine. You know, I'll I'll just I'll be thinking dark shit. Like think about like all the dark possibilities. If it's me, you, and Bra and Anna. Anna would be trying to figure stuff out. Me and you would just be going off. No, like, like we just got kidnapped by some terrorists. They trying to they trying to um, ransom us or something. You they trying like, to ransom us, being like, "All right, who's your who's your parents? Who's your parents' phone number?" We're just like, "Man, you guys really are poor in order to do this." <laughs> I'm like, "Damn, y'all desperate. Y'all got two agents in the black guy." Well, first off, I'm surprised I caught Anna. This bitch crazy. Me and Doppler, we just went with y'all because we're bored. But uh, it's like it's like oh no, this one gave us a fight. This one gave us a fight. They took she she killed one of our men. It's like oh, uh, well I mean I can, I can understand that. <laughs> it's like good job. Can you get this one as well? <laughs> it's like I was like don't try anything. We we already we restrained you. It's like buddy restraining doesn't do what? shit for us. <laughs> I'm like we already out the handcuffs. Like we just been, we just been sitting here pretending we still handcuffed. <laughs> it's like what just pulls our hands up. Look, <laughs> throws the handcuffs no. like nothing. No, no, we're just like, look, see, told you. <laughs> they have the guns. Put them back on. What are you gonna shoot us? No. And then you wanted us ransom. <laughs> but um, look, what's the whole what's the whole point of this episode? It was supposed to be supernatural, and it delved into stupid. Oh yeah, right. Yeah, right. <laughs> How do you think? How do you think? Here's here's a better question. How would you react if you actually saw the Loch Ness monster? I'm like, holy shit, you're real. <laughs> Let me eat you. <laughs> mm, I wonder how you taste. It's like, holy shit, you're real. Now, how do you taste? <laughs> like, hmm, I have been craving some seafood recently. <laughs> seafood. <laughs> <laughs> That joke is stupid, but it was still hilarious. <laughs> but um, that was funny yeah, because um, we have the same joke with um Cthulhu. <laughs> Everybody's gonna be going insane trying to figure out what he is, and then there's me like, I don't care what you is, I just want to know how he oh, tastes. Come oh, here. <laughs> it just starts gnawing. Is like he looks at you. What the fuck are you doing? <laughs> Right. It's like I'm hungry. Starts takes takes it's like starts cutting off slices. He has a grill <laughs> next to him. Has a grill next to him. <laughs> Puts in a burger. Mm, this is actually pretty delicious. It's like just looking down at me, but like, he's he's just looking at you like the fuck are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> that's that's all he is because he's not gonna, not gonna attack you because he's harmless. He's not gonna attack you because like they don't care about humans. 
I know, they're gonna be like, how come this one's not going insane? We we don't know. Like he he didn't even look yeah. at us yet, but here's the funny thing, right? So people people have uh, I, I watched a video before this about like uh like it's like why does why does Cthulhu why does Cthulhu like you know does not give two shits about us? And you know it makes sense. He's an all powerful he's an all powerful being who is who is an elder one who like or an older uh, I think it's elder I don't know I forgot what they're called old ones I think it's something like that and they're beings that are like beyond beyond human human comprehension right and so it's like and so they were talking about like if an ant if an ant colony gathered gathered in gathered in my house and started and started summoning started like chanting my name I would also be questioning I would also be questioning and go all over to go over to find out what's going on no the fuck I'm not I'm leaving I would question it. I'd be like, "What the fuck? How do you know my names?" <laughs> uh, that's that. Look, I'm like, "How the fuck you know my name? We were sent here by that old one." I'm like, yeah, okay. Well, tell him I'm not available and I'm gone. We'll tell him. It's like, no, no. It's like, how do you know my name? Oh, the old one has spoken. I'm not an old one. I am only. I'm only uh, a young adult. Nineteen. I'm only nineteen, <laughs> bitch. I'm only 19, but my mind is older. <laughs> I'm 19 by age, 35 by experience, and then my and then my 80s by mindset. Mindset is two. What do you mean? Get it right. Get it right. One. <laughs> but no, like. You set you set that up you set that up and I was just immediately like Hamilton. <laughs> I'm only nineteen, but my mind is old and can be fine. I was when I once when I started singing um, Hamilton at one point, and I questioned well, you. Your... How do you know Hamilton? <laughs> and then I remembered I looked out of my hoodie and I'm like, hmm. Like you're sitting in your Hamilton hood. I'm like. I wonder how I know about Hamilton. I I wonder. <laughs> you. <laughs> oh yeah. But um. Okay, but going back to the question, how would you kill a skeleton? <laughs> the actual question. How would I kill a skeleton? Do you think if you completely separate the head and the short and the shorter body, it would die? That could that could possibly work. Or or ignore the skeleton and go straight for the necromancer. <laughs> that that definitely works. Because as long as there's no power being supplied to it, it should die. Exactly. Now, if only we could find the necromancer in Big Boo's hunt. God, that that would put an end to that. Yeah. <laughs> now he's he's outside the map. He's at that portal that we can't get to. We're not gonna get to that portal. We probably like, could. We, we're both gonna need a bow and a and a, and a crawl controller, or like two yeah. bows each. Yeah. But um uh, What's another good topic? Like an actual good topic that we should just talk about. Oh no, well we didn't we didn't we didn't talk about this on recording. We were gonna technically talk about it on recording. But what? Do you yeah, do you remember do you remember uh how Mickey that uh, Mickey uh what's his name? Uh Chucky, Chucky Cheese logo originally looked. Oh yeah, but um, let's see. Yeah, that, that, that episode. That shit, man. Yeah, that look, that looks weird now. And I'm not joking. I passed by a Chucky Cheese just a few minutes, and it has that logo, the new logo, and I'm like, that looks so weird. It looks creepy. <laughs> but anyways, everyone, thank you for coming to the first tavern for today. I'm gonna close down for the for the night. Hope y'all have no. I hope y'all had enough enjoyment. If not, we don't know what to if do. If not, y'all not have no bitches. <laughs>
<laughs> but anyway, subscribe to pay your tabs. Come again soon. And we'll see you again next time. Later.